Hey there. I'm here today to talk to you about uh, Star Trek Voyager and how it's a little bit racial. Oh wait, before you say anything, think about it. Janeway? Sounds a lot like John Wayne. Tuvok? Sounds a lot like two bucks a chicken to me. And what about Jacote? Sounds a lot like Lakota Nation. But anyways, I'm mostly here to talk about Ensign Kim. You know, you guys might not know it, but I'm half Asian. And I really take offense to those Voyager episodes. Especially when they make fun of them. I can't stand it. And they have uh, Ensign Kim do, do Janeway's laundry. I can't stand that episode. I can't stand it. It drove me crazy. I just wish I could get my hands on them. So I could strangle those executive producers that made that show. That's all I can say about that. But anyways, yeah, I wanted to show you a clip just to prove my point. Unless you wish to change the nature of our affiliation. What do you mean? I may be new to individuality, but I'm not ignorant of human behavior. I've noticed your attempts to engage me in idle conversation. And I see the way your pupils dilate when you look at my body. I don't know what you're talking about. Obviously, you've suggested a visit to the holodeck in the hopes of creating a romantic mood. Are you in love with me, Ensign? Well, no. Then you wish to copulate? No! <laughs> I mean, I... I, I don't know what I mean. All of these elaborate rituals of deception. I didn't realize becoming human again would be such a challenge. Sexuality is particularly complex. As Borg, we had no need for seduction, no time for single cell fertilization. We saw a species we wanted and we assimilated it. Nevertheless, I am willing to explore my humanity. Take off your clothes. Uh. Seven. Don't be alarmed. I won't hurt you. Look, this is a little sub. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Man, that would be that ship would be rocking. I mean, would you do that? I mean, if she asks you, you know, you want to copulate, I do that. I do it. You know, that should be rocking. The nurse damage will be down. Oh man, I can't believe it. You know, that's the thing with Hollywood. They always make us Asians look like we're uh, either one or two things. Either we're very passive and meek, or we're just oversexed. Just oversexed, I can't believe it. And also, of course, they make uh, NC Kim look like he's under sex, underrated, you know, under everything. You know, and that's the thing about him. You know, like, what about Lieutenant Paris? You know, the white guy? They make him lieutenant right off, you know? But NC Kim is on there seven years still. Ensign, that's what they do to Asian, us Asian guys. I can't stand it. Racism has finest Hollywood style. I damn it. Damn it. I mean, oh man, that makes me so mad. Oh, I was only going to show you that one clip. I'm going to show you a second one just to prove my point even more. So you guys can believe it. So we're very impressed. They were calling me up and they are saying, So, uh, what else is going to be featuring you this season? And the original title for the disease was Alien Love Story. That was the title. And it was Kim's love affair with this alien woman. Don't worry, nobody saw us leave. And they changed the title to the disease. You've got 30 seconds before I have to uh, drag you to sick bay. Captain, I am not sick. I didn't disobey your orders because I'm under some alien influence. I disobeyed your orders because Tal and I are in love. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. You heard that? You heard that? It's going to be called Love Story, and then they change it to the disease. That's what they think about us Asians, like we're some sort of disease or something. That's what Hollywood thinks about us. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Oh, man. I'm so mad. Oh, man. You know, I'll tell you one thing. If those executive producers ever came down to Chinatown, I'd teach them a lesson. A lesson they never forget. Oh, man. You know, one thing. They might not come out. Trying to tell if they ever mess with me. I can tell you that much. Makes me so mad. Well, anyways, I guess that's it. That's all I really had to say. I'm glad I got that off my chest, you know. Anyways, I guess I'll see you guys later. Peace.